Clark County, where health officials working tonight to track down the source of a COVID outbreak at Peace Health Medical Center in Vancouver. 14 people have tested positive, including four staff members, and only one of the workers was fully vaccinated. Wayne Haverly has been digging deeper into this story. He joins us live tonight. What did you discover, Wayne? Well, five of those 14, they are vaccinated, and they were vaccinated, but of those uh, uh, of those five, none of them got sick. They were all asymptomatic, but the rest, they did get sick. Some of them severe. The good news right now is that at this point, no one is in the ICU. All patient visits have stopped at Peace Health Medical Center after an outbreak of COVID-19 erupted on the second floor of the Mother Joseph building. We want to be able to stop wearing masks and stop social distancing, and, uh, and I get that and very sympathetic to that. But this really is a wake up call, I think, that if it can happen here, it can happen anywhere. The first COVID-19 case was discovered in a patient during a routine test on July 10th. More testing revealed 14 positive cases, including four health care workers. Only one of those health care workers was fully vaccinated. The people who are fully vaccinated did not have symptoms. And I would also point out that people who are fully vaccinated have lower viral loads and are less likely to transmit infection than people who are not uh, vaccinated. Peace Health currently does not require its health care workers to get vaccinated. Do you have a percentage on how many of your health care workers have been vaccinated? So we are roughly at 75%. Dr. Neville says in response to the outbreak, Peace Health will develop stricter protocols to protect patients from their unvaccinated health care workers. Investigators don't know if that's what happened here, but it is one of three possible scenarios. The other two, a patient was carrying the disease but didn't test positive during admission, or a visitor brought in the disease. If a place as safe as Peace Health Southwest with you know extraordinary experience taking care of COVID patients and an extraordinary public safety record can have an outbreak like this, it really shows that we are all extremely vulnerable to COVID re-emerging. Yeah, and healthcare uh, professionals, they've already reached out to uh, several dozen patients and staff members who, are, who may have been exposed, so they're awaiting those tests. They're also testing to see if these cases are part of that uh, Delta variant that we've been hearing about, the more contagious form of this, and they're waiting for those test results. But I checked with the state, and uh, state health officials say right now 41% of all cases in Washington state are that new Delta variant. Live in Vancouver, Wayne Haverly, Coin 6 News.